Hello and welcome to an original Retry This production. Today I'll be offering my C++ tutorial number 6, I believe. I think teaching you how to use the floating point variable in C++. Now the floating point variable is just a subcategory of integer variables. Except they kind of have their own category. A floating point variable is just basically a decimal. A decimal variable, decimal integer. So, to declare a floating point number, or decimal, as better known, just type in the phrase double. Then you can have whatever number you want. Double my number, heh, <laughs> double my number, 0 0.1. See out my number, and up. Now, uh, this is just basically the same thing. To add on to a floating point number. Now, I'm not sure. I haven't tested it, but I'm not sure if you can add an integer variable with a floating point number. I'm not sure. But the same thing as all the other integers. My number plus equals 0 0.5. See out. My number. And, uh, oh, I'm sure you can. So, see out. Say, 0 0.5 plus 1. If this works, then you can see how floating point numbers about it out. So, so, 0 0.5 plus 1. And so, that's basically all there is to it. You can subtract, divide, multiply, do all the same things you can with integer variables. If you want to learn more about integer variables, you can watch my tutorial my earlier tutorial about it. I'll see this out really quick. Yeah, I was right. You can see them out with integers. So we have 0 0.1, then we added 0 0.5 and got 0 0.6. And then we got 1.5, because 0 0.5 plus 1. So yeah, that's basically all there is to it, to floating point numbers. Do all the same things with integer variables. Add integer variables and floating point numbers together. I'm saying you're wrong. They're not floating point variables. They're floating point numbers. No. This has been a retry this production, and I hope you enjoyed.